whales are among the largest creatures to ever live on Earth. Up to 180 tons and more than 100 feet long. A single whale can produce up to 3,000 gallons of oil. Even today, whale oil is used by NASA. The Hubble Space Telescope runs on it. Whaling is one of the North's biggest industries, bringing in $11 million a year. But the human cost is also high. Half of all ships will eventually be lost at sea. Few men are willing to take the risk. But it's an opportunity for African Americans. 20,000 free men and escaped slaves take to the seas. John Thompson is a runaway from Maryland. I have a family in Philadelphia, but fearing to remain there any longer, I thought I would go on a whaling voyage where I stood least chance of being arrested by slave hunters. The equal opportunity offered in whaling is ahead of its time. Here, a colored man is only known and looked upon as a man and is promoted in rank according to his ability and skill to perform the same duties as a white man. The whaling industry offered an ex-slave like John Thompson the possibility of social and economic fluidity, mobility, and acceptance in a way, even in the North, that was not possible for black people otherwise. The man on the lookout cried out, There she blows! There were four whales in sight, not more than three-fourths of a mile distant. It takes hours to kill them. They use state-of-the-art harpoons, invented by runaway slave Lewis Temple. The whale can only be killed by lancing him under the fin, which is a work of much skill and practice. A monster, terrible in his fury, able to shiver the boat in atoms by one stroke of his tail. <laughs> 